I want you to listen to this person for a second and then I'm going to give you my thoughts. I see a lot of people saying this in my comment section, how, you know, black people don't stick together, blah, 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 blah. The Barbie movie did not have rape, domestic violence, slaves, child molestation. The Barbie movie did not have any of that. You understand what I'm saying? Um, the Little Mermaid didn't have any of that. Um... Whatever remake y'all are about to say did not have any of those things that I just fucking named that came out in 2023. So recently I did a YouTube video on why I wasn't really interested in the color purple. Some remakes are good and some remakes are flaps. And a lot of it just has to do with the fact that I am tired of looking at anything that speaks to the pain of black women. Barbie was a happy movie. You understand what I'm saying? Barbie was a happy movie. I don't want to see it. I don't want to hear about it. I mean, and it's not just black women. It's anything in a black community. People don't want trauma movies. People don't want trauma movies. We want happy movies. So if you are going to do a remake, Make it happy. Much of what we pay attention to or watch is always based off of like black women being harmed or black men are drug dealers or they're in these awful roles. We never show like regular old regular movies where we're just like laughing and having fun. Like why can't we just be silly? Why can't we just... So when it comes to black people sticking together, I'm sorry, but I don't want to see a trauma movie. You understand what I'm saying? Why can't we start with something new? I think the biggest thing for me is like, can we just be innovative and show something else? Can we show black women inventing things and, and laughing or having our own fashion movie or anything? There's so many other stories that we can tell, and it doesn't always have to be an autobiography. It doesn't always have to be historical. Why can't it be silly? Why can't it be funny? Why can't we have a romance? Like, why can't it just be about black women going into space? I don't know, black women fighting the alien, or not even black women, just in general. Why can't black people be in, like, normal movies? I'm just tired of seeing us in these same movies. And then what they try to do is to say like, oh, you don't want to support black content in black movies. I'm like, no, I don't feel like being sad all the time. I don't want to see anybody being abused or molested or talk to like a POS. I don't want to see it. I'm just over it. So no, I did not go support the color purple because I don't want to see it. I don't want to hear about it. If I want to see the color purple, I'll watch, I'll watch the original. I don't want to see this kind of content anymore. Um, nevertheless, that's just where I'm at with it. I didn't see the Barbie movie. My daughter saw it twice because she had to go to two birthday parties where they were showing it. I'm like, all right, whatever. Sometimes you just want to just hee-haw right and trust me i am aware of who i am and what i look like i know i am a, a regular old blackity black black but you know what sometimes i don't want to have to be reminded about my blackness i just want to go watch something i want to go see an adventure i feel like whenever we have these black ensembles it has to be so emotional and draining and sometimes maybe it's just hey you know, maybe we have an ensemble cast and they go on vacation and there's, I don't know, they, they run into a bunch of riches or they got to figure out how to get off the island. I don't know. Like, why can't it just be some regular old regular? Black people do not want to see child molestation, rape, um, domestic violence, slavery. We don't want to see that. We don't want to see that. One of my favorite movies, it wasn't, it was, it was Hope Floats. It had Sandra Bullock in it. That's one of my favorite movies. Um, I think about old movies like Steel Magnolias. I don't know why my family is so loud. It was just a regular movie. See, my son is trying me. He is all the way trying me. 
I don't want to see movies like The Color Purple. I never even saw Precious. And the, the woman who just spoke, she brought up a really good point. I'm sure, I am sure Jews don't want to see movies about the Holocaust. I had to watch the Holocaust when I was in, I had to watch a Holocaust movie when I was in high school. I didn't want to see that shit. I'm sure, I'm sure um, Jews do not want a remake of the Holocaust. Okay? You don't see like the Jewish population wanting to constantly relive Schindler's, Schindler's List. Like, no. It doesn't matter what race you are. I am sure these motherfuckers do not want any more trauma movies. I think if someone was to come out with a with a Holocaust movie, the Jews would be pissed. Why are you why are you doing a remake of this? We already know what happened. Jews got executed, literally. Do you see like um, the Japanese wanting to relive, you know, um, when the atomic bomb was dropped on was it Nagasaki? Now granted, they were the original aggressors, but like, do you think they want to relive that? But no, not the blackity black blacks, especially the ones in America. The world has enough trauma. We going through trauma every day. I don't want to go to the movies and pay money for a trauma film. I can go outside for that. Why don't we make people laugh? Why don't we invoke emotion based off of good acting, right? About different types of stories. They think, I mean, I don't know about... Of a feel-good story, a romance story, a scientific story. You don't have to constantly be down and out. It could be on anything. It, it, I just, I'm just sick of it. So anyway, um, that's all I got.